third country in our honeymoon, and this is how we were woken up at 3 a.m. We were low-key scared at first, but it turned out it was just science for Ramadan. Day one in Morocco, and we got catfished. We booked a photo shoot on Airbnb, and it was just not the same fella who showed up at all. But the picture turned out fine, so it was chill. And then, of course, we had to go back to the Airbnb because Louis stained his pants, as he does at least once a day. Oops. There's not a single piece of clothing he owns that doesn't have at least one stain. Low-key, we got catfished again. We went to the perfume museum, and it was a tenner to get in for both of us. But then they made you pay $60 for a perfume, which we thought was included in the ticket prices, but it wasn't, so go at your own discretion. After that, we roamed around the beautiful streets and markets of Marrakesh before stopping at this gorgeous restaurant to get some grub. After that, this happened. They literally keep calling me Shakira. The only Spanish-speaking person they've ever heard of in their life. They're calling me skinny, skinny, skinny. Starving Maverick, skinny, skinny boy. Shakira. This is the first cold drink we've had. As soon as I felt the cold, I was like... <sighs> She's been like, why is every drink warm? But I kind of want henna. Last time I was here and got henna, the person I went with got held ransom. That's a story for another day.